Hello everybody, it's Faith from Fire Sign Tarot. I hope everyone is well. Virgo! You're the last one. Your reading ends the set. Super excited, just throwing that out there. So, uh, I think I'm ready with this. Put that away. Okay. Let's get to it. Heavenly Father, Mother Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, and Archangels, thank you so much for being with me one last time this evening. I appreciate you. Please give me the clarity of mind and the peace of heart to bring Virgo, Sun, Moon, and Rising Venus to their highest good. Thank you for the many blessings you have bestowed upon me. Please help me to guide them to their blessings. Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising Venus. All right. One to show, one to go from the Wisdom Oracle. Change in the wind. All right, one to go. I didn't see it. Oh, I'm not reading with that. I'm reading with this. Okay. Change in the wind. I'm getting ahead of myself. Number 12. Change in the wind. A sense that unseen change has been initiated. Preparation for a storm. Awareness that your plans are not on firm ground. Feeling a shift. Uncertainty about which direction the winds will blow. It is human nature to yearn for certainty and resist change, to want the world to remain consistent like a zebra's stripes. Yet, nothing in human experience is black and white, nor will anything remain static. The one thing guaranteed is change. Now is the time of transformation as outer conditions are temporarily moving out of sync with your desires and expectations. Stay the course. And remember that even storms serve to clear the air, scatter seeds and nourish the soil for better things ahead. Life is about to get interesting. Anticipate with curiosity as you wonder what is coming in on the shifting winds. The unknown is where the magic lies. All right. Virgo, sun, moon, rising, Venus. I gotta hurry up and get this done. The boy's getting restless. He wants some more soup. He came home for sick from school today. Sure you do. He's like, I don't want soup, Mom. I want to be able to sleep. <laughs> Being loud. I told him to put it in his earbuds. All right. One more on that one. Temperance reversed. Why are you restless? Why are you impatient? Could be a Sagittarius you're dealing with. Hmm. Eight of Cups was at the bottom of the deck. Somebody walking away from something? Somebody walk away from you?
Why is the Two of Pentacles here? King of Cups reversed. Knight of Pentacles, it's reversed. I don't know if I'm going to hang out still thinking about it because this is moving super slow and they don't share their feelings and I'm getting a little impatient. Virgo, it's like I can hear you. It's either I can hear you or I can hear them. But somebody's getting impatient because something's moving too slow. Somebody getting restless. Why the four swords reversed here? Eight pentacles reversed. Ten wands. High Priestess, three wands reversed. Somebody being secretive. It's been a change in the wind, hasn't there? Change in the wind. Oh my. Gotta throw one more on it. I don't like what I'm hearing. I don't like what I'm hearing. I don't like what I'm sentencing. I don't like what I'm feeling. Knight of Swords reversed. Y'all ain't talking about it. Somebody's being secretive with their phone. Somebody's got a screen lock on. Okay, split story. For some of you, somebody's not putting the work into the relationship. And for some of you, y'all driving by where they work and they ain't there when they say they are. Take it however it resonates. That's what I'm sensing. That's what I'm feeling. That's what I'm hearing. There's a change in the wind. Somebody's burdened. Why is the Page of Pentacles here? Why are the Page of Pentacles showing up a second time? Why is the Page of Pentacles here? Ace of Swords, Six of Pentacles. Page of Wands reversed. King of Rods reversed. Bottom of the deck. One more. Eight Swords. Ace of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Whoa! Whoa! Slow your roll. Slow your roll. Slow your roll. Slow your roll. Things move slowly. Somebody wants to make sure things are equal. But they're not talking like they used to and somebody's getting all paranoid. Somebody feels a change in the wind. Ace of Cups, 
Ace of Swords. Things are changing. Somebody needs to have a conversation. Like right now. Don't be getting all impatient. Before this goes too far, things need to be sorted out. Why is the King of Pentacles reversed here? Oh, shoot. Page Swords reversed. Sometimes they tell us things we don't want to hear. Four rods reversed. Oh. And there it came tumbling down. There was three upside down kings. Upside down king of cups. Upside down king of rods. Upside down king of pentacles. The wheel of fortune reversed. One on that upside down wheel. Lovers reversed. Page of Nine of Pentacles reversed. Knight of Wands, bottom of the deck. You cannot have your cake and eat it too. Some things are about to be revealed, possibly through a third party. I feel like y'all got to sit down and have a conversation before a little page of swords reversed here opens his mouth, or her mouth, their mouth. Because it's kind of like a game of telephone. You ever play telephone when you were a kid? You whisper into the next person's ear? See how messed up the message is between the first person and the last person? That's how rumors get started. Why is the Ten of Rods reversed down here at the end? Justice. Judgment. Oh! The sword comes down and the trumpets blow. Can this be resurrected or not? Somebody going to get cut out. Somebody going to drop the sticks. Six swords. Page of pentacles reversed. Pull back their pentacle. Things coming to a dead stop. Six wands at the bottom of the deck. Five pentacles and the magician reversed. Ten swords. King of wands reversed. Chariot. Seven swords. Ten cups. Five wands. King of pentacles. I'm not going to keep going. Ace of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Mm. Y'all gotta have a conversation before things get out of hand. Or maybe that's what's required by the change of the wind. Things getting a little out of hand. Temperance reverse, two cups reverse. There's that page of swords again. The magician in the upright. Three wands. The chariot again. Knight of swords again. Three cups. You know what? Four pentacles reversed. Maybe it is a change in the wind. Ten. King of wands reversed. The wheel of fortune was upside down, but upside down or right side up, there's no arguing with it. It's divine timing and divine intervention either way.
Change in the wind, storms knock down towers, and they scatter seeds. They bring the rain. It helps things grow. And sometimes in order for things to grow, things have to move out the way so the sun can shine where it needs to shine. Soulmates, number 41. One of my favorite cards. You know what a soulmate is, right? They don't always hang out. It's a reason or a season. Sometimes it's both. Harmonious partnerships, love, friendship, companionship, a relationship, fostering personal growth. I'm going to say it again. A relationship fostering personal growth. You are meant to evolve and transform the companionship of others. Certain people enter into your life in order to take you to the next level of healing, consciousness, and authenticity. It is always a reciprocal experience, although the results for each of you may vary. You know these people by the strong pull drawing you toward them, and sometimes by a strong aversion to them initially, too. Soulmates can be friends for life, or remain in your life for only a short time. No matter what, you will be changed in ways you cannot possibly fathom now. Pay attention to these people today. They are your greatest gifts. Okay, Virgo. Know that you are loved friends. Be blessed. Take care of you. I will catch you next time we go around the wheel.